Okay, today I'm going to be taking my second try at crushing peanuts in order to make peanut butter. So I crushed peanuts before to make peanut butter, and a lot of people weren't very impressed with the results because it was pretty crumbly and dry. There are a lot of people saying that's not how peanut butter is made, you need more ingredients for peanut butter. So I wanted to try again to try to make as creamy of peanut butter as I can. And I also wanted to show you that it can be that peanut butter has the only ingredient of peanuts in it. Okay, this is an example of pure peanut butter. So it just has peanuts in here, it grinds it, peanut butter comes out the bottom. See? There we go, see? It's just pure peanuts. Let's see if my peanut butter can get as good as this in my hydraulic press. Okay, so the way I'm going to do this differently is not put a ton of peanuts in there because when I put a lot of peanuts in there, they all just squish out the sides and they end up not even getting crushed. So I'm gonna do only a few at a time and do lots of layers of that and just keep putting in a few, crush it, put in a few, crush it, and try to get the end result to be creamy peanut butter. And as with a lot of things I end up doing, I'm using duct tape here. So I'm just trying to catch everything that gets pressed out and then put it back in and re-crush it. Okay, here we go. Making peanut butter, round two. Three, two, one. Okay, so let's gather up our creamy peanut butter. Okay, you can check how creamy this is. That looks pretty good. How about we do a blind taste test and see whether we like hydraulic press peanut butter or the peanut butter from the grinder that I got from the store. Okay, for the blind taste test, my wife has placed one spoon in one hand and one in the other. I don't know which is which. And I will eat them and then she'll tell me which one was which after I decide which one's better. Okay, for the first one. Pretty good. It's really hard to eat a spoonful of peanut butter. Okay, the next one. Definitely like the second one better. Let's see which was which. Okay, the winner was the hydraulic press peanut butter. So I made better creamy peanut butter in the hydraulic press than a peanut grinder to make peanut butter. How about that? Hey everyone, thanks for watching another episode of Hydraulic Press Action. If you haven't subscribed yet, remember to hit subscribe. And if you want to see anything get crushed in the hydraulic press, let me know in the comments section. And also, if you want to see me put anything in my vacuum chamber, give me some ideas in the comments section, and I'll see you next time.